right welcome back to line of simsimi kitchen here in the kitchen today i made a special menu and it's honey glazed roast breadfruit fried with codfish and ackee and for refreshment it's jackfruit punch jackfruit punch you got it jackfruit punch okay guys i know everybody been asking about my hair yes it's natural but don't expect me to have it every day because it's very very difficult to maintain so guys let's jump into the show hi everyone welcome back to line seems to my kitchen here in the kitchen today i have aki and codfish my mom brought back some lovely ackies from Jamaica. So I'm going to go ahead and pour it in the boiling water for it to cook. Okay. Here I have the codfish. Just going to go ahead and add it to the boiling water. And guys, the codfish is salt. So I won't add no salt to the ingredients. So the ackee and the saltfish will cook for at least 15 to 20 minutes. And then I'm gonna go ahead and check back on it. Lioness Simsima, the kitchen look good today. You get new supply. Oh yeah. My mother went to Jamaica. She brought me back some roast breadfruit, ackee, and jackfruit and fish. She care about enough something can give me. That me can cook so today we are gonna do some honey glazed fried breadfruit with ackee and saltfish and for refreshment we are gonna throw down some jackfruit punch no go nowhere stay right there it's time to cook the codfish with ackee Get all your olive oil, pour some in the pan, pour enough, because we want some, some gravy to eat with the honey glazed bread food today. So make it pot hot, then we are going to put some seasonings in there when it's hot. So just get at least one minute or half a minute, because depends on how your stove stays still. If your stove no burn bright <laughs> if the stove not burn bright then turn it up because we want to help it hot when we put the tomato and the scallion and the thyme and the pepper in there we want you to go push we want you to fry we want you to load frying sound okay so make we get a little bit of time and then we're gonna put the ingredients them in the pot so make the best way if you find to be all hot, I just will put something in there like this. It's still not hot, so you have to wait a little bit. So make we wait. So we're gonna wait together, right? So guys, I must say that one of my favorite favorite food is fried breadfruit. But today I'm gonna put a twist on it and put some honey just to glaze it and then I fried it. You know? So make we see. All that go today and we're gonna taste it together today and we're gonna tell you if it tastes good or bad but I bet it all tastes good I my I my creation this you understand so we're with honey as we get hot so meanwhile the aloe will get hot may go show you what aki is so this is what they call the aki okay so early in the video I cooked the aki with the codfish so the reason why I had to cook the codfish is because it's really salty and before I even cook it I, I put it in a pot of cold water to soak for a little bit and then I cooked it because I want the salt to you know to remove some of the saltiness from the codfish so it looked like it pot hot now you know so make we try yeah man it pot hot see there it hot so we're gonna put some tomato, scallion down in. It's a tomato. Alright, now let nothing box, we'll put everything in. So this are the hot pepper and the thyme. We'll put everything in today. Okay. 
So just let me move it around a bit. And then move it around. Okay, so guys, what I'm doing is just mixing it around. And I'm going to make it fry for a little bit. Okay, just a little bit. And then I'm going to add the cod fish. So just let it cook for a little bit and then I'm going to add the cod fish, okay? So guys, when I was growing up in Jamaica, one of my favorite food was jackfruit. I love jackfruit. I used to come home from school and go straight to the jackfruit tree to see if there's a ripe jackfruit. Boy, oh boy. Jackfruit brings back a lot of memories, guys. A lot of memories. So now, I'm just going to go ahead and add the cod fish, okay? And then we're going to do the same thing. Break it up a little if you can. Just break it up a little, okay? Not a lot, just a little, okay? So just mix it around. Just mix it around. Just all cook it a little bit, all right? Just a little bit. We make all our seasoning blend together right now, guys. All of it blending together, just lovely, just lovely. So, make gonna make it cook for a little bit, and then I'm gonna go ahead and add the aki, okay? Cause the aki, guys, is soft. So once I add the the aki to the codfish and the rest of the ingredients. I'm not going to stir it that much. I'm not going to stir it because I don't want my ackee to be all smooshy. We don't want a smooshy ackee over here. We want our ackee to stay not good. Okay? So now I'm going to add the ackee to it. I'm just going to give it two good turn. And I'm going to leave it. Try to blend together. But not, not a lot of turn because I don't want the ackee to get smushed and smashed. You want the ackee to stay firm. You understand? See? Just like this. You want the ackee to look just like this. See? Firm. So I'm going to turn on the flame now, guys. I'm turning the flame down. Because I want the ingredients to blend together. So there I turn it down. Not too much stirring when you put the ackee in. Guys, you could get some aki from the Jamaican stores. It's in a can. It tastes just as lovely as the aki that my mom brought up straight from Jamaica off the tree. So you can get that aki at the Jamaican store from a can. It's good. I tried it many times because, you know, not all the time I have the straight aki from off the tree. Guys, I know you guys think I forgot the black pepper, but I did not. The black pepper is right here so just sprinkle a bit of black pepper over it i mean i tell you the best aki you got tears see they look funny the aki look good the pot a bubble a long time in i eat some aki and codfish but today me go eat up all i me go name it so no go nowhere Come and go do the fry bread food with honey. So no go nowhere. Stay away uno there. Here you have the roast bread fruit. So now guys, my mom had to peel it because she can't take it through the airport unpeeled. So they roast it in Jamaica and then they peel the skin off because you know it was black. So now I'm just going to slice it just like this, guys. So, see? Just slice it. Just like this. Okay, I put the knife down. And this is how you slice it. And then we're just going to glaze it, okay? So guys, I'm going to go ahead and slice up some more and then, you know what guys, just let me show you. This is the honey, so I'm what I'm doing now is just glazing it with honey, okay? And then I'm going to go ahead and fry it. Yes guys, it's time to put the breadfruit in the frying pot. 
already glazed it with the honey so it's time to fry it so see me glazy so i'm gonna put in a frying pan the whole hot man so on one side me glaze already when me turn it over me go glaze the other side so so it's a go on okay so that's what we're doing today glaze roast breadfruit with ackee and cod fish okay so it's a go on fry now and as soon as it gets a little brown color i'm gonna turn it over guys so i'm just gonna let it stay for at least say one minute and then i'm gonna turn it to the other side and i'm gonna glaze it okay so now it's a fry so it don't take a little while to fry one minute it can be a lot of time depends on what type of rush you in but i'm not in no rush today because i'm just not in a rush guys no rush at all so this is the roast breadfruit that my mom bought from jamaica she went to jamaica the other day and she brought me back some goodies so i'm gonna be using a lot of her goodies in the kitchen so guys come back for more amazing menus and more hold on let's check let's check let's check okay there you have it it's a bit brown so we're just gonna go ahead and glaze it again with some honey okay so let's turn let's turn another one that's the color you're looking for when you turn over your breadfruit and glaze it with some more honey okay let's turn over another one and we're gonna do the rest of the breadfruit the same okay just gonna use the honey and glaze it okay i can't waste i can't wait to taste this delicious delicious recipe that i have here the delicious meal that i'm preparing so so now guys we're going to go ahead and make the jackfruit punch so don't go nowhere here you have the ingredients for the jackfruit punch here you have 10 pieces of jackfruit, crushed ice, one cup whole milk, also we have condensed milk for sweet. Guys, you don't have to put a lot of condensed milk, it's just for your taste. If you want it well sweet, you add a little bit more. So guys, it's time to blend. So we're going to go ahead and blend all the ingredients together to make the jackfruit punch. So first I'm going to go ahead and pour the one cup milk in. Here you have the milk. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and pour it in. Here you have the jackfruit pieces of jackfruit we call these pulps I don't know what you guys call it in other country but we call these jackfruit pulps so we're gonna go ahead and pour it in there are always one piece left at the bottom for some reason here we have some crushed ice pour it in Here you have condensed milk, condensed milk. So guys, I'm just gonna add some to it, not a lot. Okay, all right, that's enough. Alrighty, 
then we're just gonna go ahead and add the lid on the blender close it and blend <laughs> the jackfruit punch guys it looks amazing jackfruit punch So it's time to taste this delicious meal. So guys, let's start with the ackee and codfish. Look guys, get some pepper, hot pepper. It's really good. It's really, really good. Let's have another taste. I don't know about you guys, but this is one of my favorite meal. Codfish with roast fried glazed breadfruit. Wow. This breadfruit is the best I ever had. Oh my goodness. Mmm. Wow. It's really, really good. You should try it. It's really good. Wow. Lioness Sim Sim did it again. It's the best I ever had. Let's try the jackfruit punch. Mix it around. Take a big sip. Wow. It's really really good you should try it thank you for joining lioness sim simma thank you for subscribing liking sharing and thanks all the wonderful people in Jamaica who send me breadfruit aki codfish and jackfruit thank you guys so much love y'all